And I apologize for the intense intro, but this is my new and improved custom Monster Rock figure. And um, this was a ordered piece from one of my customers. And after about a week and a half worth of work, he is finally completed. I um, used a, what is it? I used a Scorpion Venom figure for the base of the custom. Resculpted his entire head, gave him those weird nostril things that Monster Rock has. Um, and I gave him the older style tentacles here because, you know, that's just the one seen on him in the game. And in my first version of this, I used the more advanced looking tentacles that can be found on the Marvel Select Dr. Octopus. But this version just looks menacing. And then I um, went ahead and gave him a full repaint. Kind of like a like a couple different shades of red. Then I went over it with some dark shading. And then after that, went ahead and did a clear coat. And I also had to remove this guy's tongue, which really wasn't an easy thing to do. <laughs> but, you know, it'd be really cool to see him more, well, to have seen more of him in a game. Instead of, you know, literally running for your life and being scared, like, <laughs> out of your wits. I just still remember playing that game, and I don't know, it's just my hands start sweating, I'm shaking, you know, starting to freak out, he's starting, and in the parts in the game where, you know, you look like you get away from him, because this little icon kind of gets far away from your little spider emblem icon, and then you think you're in the safe, but then he just right there appears behind you, and <laughs> yeah. But anyways, um, you guys, let me know what you think about this, and tell me. What symbiote character would you like to see next? <laughs> the comments with the most thumbs up will be the winner. <laughs>